Unilever is to invest 35 million euros building an oil palm processing plant at Chifopraso in the central region of Ghana. The mill and the expansion of the existing oil palm plantation will create 3,000 jobs. And this came up when the group chief executive officer of Unilever, Paul Pullman, met with the vice president, Dr. Mahmoudou Baumia, at the Flagstaff House in Accra. Edward Nyako reports. Unilever Ghana is the largest producer and retailer of consumer goods in Ghana. It will mark its 100 years anniversary in 2019. The last 97 years have seen the British Dutch giant dominating the market in Ghana, with almost every house using one of its products, such as Pepsodent, Life Boy, Omo, Sunlight, Lux, and Kiso. And in pursuit of its goal of leading the market not only in Ghana but in Africa, the company says it will increase its investment to create 5 million jobs on the continent. The group chief executive officer of Unilever, Mr. Paul Pullman, told Ghana's vice president, Dr. Mohamed Baumia, that his company would like to expand its footprint in the country, but in a sustainable way. As we grow, we grow responsibly. Otherwise, it's not going to work. Responsibly for us means sustainably. No? Responsibly for us means a circular economy. Responsibly for us means creating decent jobs into the value chain and doing that all together. Uh, it's very clear that uh, if each of us works individually, we only bring it so far, and this is what we have. And that is why we created the Sustainable Development Goals. That's why we created goal number 17 of partnership. Uh, it's by working together that you can really reach a lot more people. Vice President said the development of the Asian Tigers, including Hong Kong, Singapore, and Taiwan, among others, was hinged on industrialization. He described the move by Unilever Ghana to expand its oil palm mill at Chivipraso as in sync with the government vision for raw material based economy to value addition one. We have a lot of raw materials across the country and, and so we want everybody to be thinking, the mindset to, to start moving towards what can we do to add value. Because the cocoa producer, I mean, if you see a bar of chocolate which is selling out there for one dollar, how much of that one dollar in that bag goes to the farmer? You know, probably five cents uh, or ten cents at the most. You know, that's that's it. You know, so we need to process, we need to, to manufacture, and that sort of thing. Dr. Bangmiya said the main goal of the government is to make Ghana the most business friendly on the continent of Africa. Ideally, we want to be a low tax economy because we believe that as a low tax economy, the incentives for more investment is there. When there's more investment, there's more production, more employment. And then you get your taxes, you know, on the consumption side, on the employment side, and so on. So we believe that, you know, you, you know, you, we, we, we don't have to try to collect it at the front end, you know, when people are bringing in goods and so on. Trying to maintain the macro stability, make sure that the deficits are low, interest rates therefore become lower, inflation is therefore lower, and then we maintain currency stability. The Unilever Group Chief Executive Officer, Mr. Paul Pullman, serves on the UN High-Level Panel on Sustainable Development Goals, which Naneku Fuadu is a co-chair of the UN SDGs Advocate Group of Eminent Personalities with the Norwegian Prime Minister, Enna Solberg. Edward Nyakun, reporting for GBC 24.